Let's look at a similar problem. This is a problem about subtracting fractions and mixed numbers, so let's solve it together. Core concept, subtracting fractions and mixed numbers. Let's look at the helpful steps and things to remember. First, convert mixed numbers to improper fractions. Then, find a common denominator when subtracting fractions. Let's understand what we know from the problem. Michael started with three and two-fifths pounds of flour. He gave three-quarters pound to his neighbor, then used one-half of what was left for cookies. Let's convert three and two-fifths to an improper fraction. First, multiply three by five, which gives us fifteen. Then add 2 to 15, which gives us 17. So 3 and 2 fifths equals 17 fifths. Now let's find a common denominator of 20. 17 fifths becomes 68 twentieths. 3 quarters becomes 15 twentieths. Subtracting gives us 53 twentieths. To find half of 53 twentieths, we multiply by one half. This gives us 53 fortieths. Converting to a mixed number, we get 1 and 13 fortieths pounds. Today we learned How to convert mixed numbers to improper fractions How to find common denominators how to subtract fractions with unlike denominators. Remember to always find a common denominator before subtracting fractions. Great job! You have finished this part.